Yo, dude, Straight Up Jack here, bringing you a new game that I'm playing called Survival Barren Roads. If you're into hardcore survival games that pits you up against real players, you definitely want to check this one out. So let's get into this gameplay. This is a gun battle I have on a mountaintop with another real player. So here we go. All right, here I am creeping around up on these mountaintops. Uh, there's a player down here I'm trying to stalk. You're going to see him pop up in a second. He's chopping some wood down here. I got a sniper rifle up on the hills. There we go. We pick up. Killed him. As I'm doing this, though, up on above me is another player. Now, I was running around with a different character or a different loadout prior to uh, where I picked up this video from. So I knew this other player had come into the game, and he's an Asian player. Most of these Asian players tend to be snipers. Uh, they're just coming into player kill. So I jumped out to grab this guy, knowing that I was probably going to be uh, facing a gun battle. So here he's retreated down the hill. Now what I really like about this dude is I've already popped him. He hasn't hit me at all. I've popped him for at least half his health. I pop him again for another hundred so hit points. It's pretty obvious this guy has heal packs on him because he would have been dead if he wasn't. But what I really like is he chooses to stay and fight, which is pretty ballsy of him, especially considering I was getting much better shots on him. Uh, he still hasn't landed a single shot on me, and I've hit him for close to, or over 200 HP, which would have killed him one and a half times over um, without the heal kits the guy obviously had to heal up. So he's sticking around. Um, there's another player in the game, too. And he takes a couple of shots somewhere along the line at somebody else. I'm not quite sure if he saw them or if he was just trying to hold me off. So we're clipping again. We clipped uh, past a couple of minutes of um, me just kind of searching for him. So here I kind of am looking for him. I know he's still down here somewhere. I'm thinking he's still down here somewhere. Might have gone up on those hills. But then I see his gunfire here. His tracer fire, but I hear nothing. And it looks like he's firing at somebody else. So I think maybe he's preoccupied. So having the high ground, I figure I still have the advantage on him. So I'm going to run down. I've got enough undulations in the terrain here that I should be able to s approach him without him seeing me. But I'm pretty sure as I find out, pretty sure that he did see me. At this point, what he's doing is there's that little mountain to the left of my viewpoint here. Now, I think he's still behind this tree, but if you watch real closely, right after I come out of zoom, you're going to see a little speck up on top of that mountain there under the text. He's There he is. See him up top there? Tiny little speck up there. He climbed up the back end of that hill... I didn't see it. He hits me twice. I have a heal pack, and I totally don't use it. And there we have it. I lost my character, plus all the stuff. And so there you have it. It's some gameplay from Survival Barren Roads. If you're really into the hardcore style game, and PUBG just doesn't cut it for you... Definitely check this one out. It's along the lines of a DayZ where the players you meet could be very treacherous and they might be fooling you into being a friend and then they're going to turn around and they're going to pull a bullet in your back and take your gun from you. That's the type of thing you'll run into here. So if that kind of thing gets your blood going like it does mine, this is definitely the one for you to check out. iOS now coming to Android very soon.